Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini June 15, 2022. Feeling a little unsettled can push you in the direction of change today. Today's Venus Uranus alignment breaks down the walls of some inhibitions, helping you tap into your intuition. You're a little less attached to the past, and getting rid of something you no longer need is likely to feel far more liberating than uncomfortable. The need for more oomph in your personal life or routines emerges. This transit brings excitement to your sector of roots, home, and family, perhaps prompting a spontaneous activity, whim, or decision to make dynamic changes and improvements to your home or personal life. It can be a lively time for home improvement or an open spirit with loved ones that encourages a fresh new approach to relating. Alternatives lead you to rethink old problems and concerns, particularly living arrangements and conditions. You want to do things a little differently today, and it's a happy, rewarding choice. Your freedom means the world to you, and that is no surprise when considering your ruling element, air. Although, despite your love for variety and all the colors of the rainbow, you're still a fixed sign. Well, today's electric Venus-Uranus conjunction is shaking things up in your personal life, whether you're ready or not. Already committed? You could be feeling a strong urge to break away from your usual routine and or shared living space. If that's the case, go for a nice drive with the windows down and clear your head. More importantly, this is an opportunity for you to embody your most authentic self. Change is coming to your work-life balance. Work may refer to your domestic duties and private responsibilities, which may unexpectedly pop up as Venus conjuncts Uranus in Taurus. You may feel like you are going through another spring cleaning phase during the conjunction as you beautify your sacred spaces. The conjunction could also encourage you to mix up your workspace. It may be time to reorganize your workspace to make it more aesthetically pleasing so that you enjoy working in that area. Expect to feel notably determined until you feel comfortable with your progress in your workspace. Having the moon in your career sector during the sun's last full day in your financial sector is doing more than just ensuring your professional instincts are sharp. This is putting the sun and moon back in harmony after an eclipsing full moon in your financial sector while leaving you with a better red on both sides of the financial fence. Take a relaxed view of life and let grass grow over old feuds. Enjoy reviving old contacts and wallowing in nostalgia. The conditions are ideal, as you will be receiving a lot of trust and affection. Let your family know how important they are to you and spend more time with them. You're feeling yourself go deeper than before into your relationship, and you're loving the sensation. Most likely your partner feels as secure as you do, and you should end up somewhere sweet. What you want seems to be magically in tune with the people you meet and socialize with. You feel a strong sense of identity and flirt with whoever you meet or find appealing. Others are content to listen to what you have to say and you benefit equally from their response, enjoying connections you make. You feel empowered by today's aspect. There are strong emotions fueling your ascent to the top, and that's how you like it. Your usual intensity is lightened by this playful transit, and that helps you in communication with others. Get to the heart of the matter with friends and find a laugh there. Give in to your feelings of vulnerability and appreciate what it means to have friends. Exercise will help you spread this energy out through your body. If there's a new project on the horizon for you, give it your full attention now. The essence of a new cycle and your own vibration is occurring, and this can only mean success when it comes to anything new and innovative. Take time to let your mind wander and your imagination run free. This is how the greatest of creative thoughts arise. When it comes to your personal life, if you are single, making a date with someone new can really lift your spirits. Even before the moon leaves your relationship sector today, any personal and or relationship tension yesterday's full moon and its clash with the sun in Gemini may have created is already turning into an opportunity. The pressure between them is gone while in his first full day back in Gemini Mercury, the planet of communication is giving anything exposed a voice. 
This not only leaves you more aware of your personal and relationship needs but just as moving into the final six days of your birthday month, there is a chance for a reset. After clashing with the sun to create yesterday's full moon, the moon's final hours in your relationship sector are in stark contrast. Already Mercury, in his first full day in Gemini is hard at work getting the communication lines open, while the moon's friendly aspect to the dwarf planet Eris is turning yesterday's wake-up calls into new resolutions. Our eyes in the sky. When was the last time something truly unexpected happened to you? If it's been a while, or something just happened but you love surprises, you have a lot to look forward to today. A Venus-Uranus conjunction in luxurious Taurus could upset your routine in the best possible way. Because the financially gifted bull is involved, your surprise might very well be money-related, such as a contest or prize announcement or news of an unexpected inheritance. Romance might be in the mix, as well as an ex contacting you unexpectedly or a current lover expressing their true feelings. Engagements, surprise parties and elopements are all possibilities under this impulsive planetary union, so be ready for anything. Thrills can be had by something you create or manifest for yourself as well, so use your best instincts when making investments or deciding whether to swipe right or left. One little decision can change the course of your entire life during this unpredictable, extraordinarily unexpected aspect. In the morning, the Sagittarius moon squares off with Saturn in Aquarius, provoking distress. We are tapped into a deep well of emotion at this time, yet we lack the means to express our feelings to others. Either our current company appears not to care, or they are preoccupied with responsibilities and don't have the bandwidth to hold space for us. This can be frustrating, causing us to become guilty for feeling too much, while everyone else seems to be getting along just fine. While this is a projection on our part, the isolation we experience is very real. Instead of seeking validation for what feels true for you, remember that your feelings don't have to be granted credence to be transformative on a personal level. Following this, the Sagittarius moon trines Neptune in Pisces, stimulating our intuition. This transit helps us to process the events of the Moon-Saturn square. It connects us to our sole purpose and allows us to see that our immediate struggles are transient. This is a good time for reaching out to others in the spirit of compassion, employing divination exercises to generate mindfulness, or for utilizing a creative practice for therapeutic means. Why do we allow emotions like guilt or shame to isolate us? Yes, our past is unique. No one else has the same lens on reality because no one else has lived identical experiences. Yet, while our history might be our own, we can still find relatable ways of sharing our stories with others to inspire communion, compassion, admiration, and respect. Fortune might land in our laps. Although luck appears randomly, it is the result of good karma gathered from previous deeds. Enjoy this magical moment.